Good morning, this is Keith All, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to learn how we could add this testimonials section to your WordPress site. I will be using the Elementor uh, page builder and um, this will give you an idea on how you could add um, different types of widgets to create this look and feel of the testimonials. So let's go over to the Elementor page builder within WordPress site. I already created a page. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a section. Okay. Um, let's uh, style or let's edit this section. Uh, let's go over to default minimum height. Let's make this 800. Um, what I'm going to first do is I'm going to add in um, a heading widget. Let's style it. Let's, uh, let's see what we got here. We've got a background color. Um, let's go over here. Go back over here. Let's center the text. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to add in an inner widget or inner section. So we have two columns. Set this over here. And within each one of these, I'm going to add um, an image box widget. Okay, let's choose an image. I'm just going to choose uh, four images for, for right now to upload. Give it a second to upload. Okay, the images are now uploaded to my media library. I'm just going to select one of them for right now. Let's insert the media. Okay, what we uh, can do here, the heading, the title and description. Let's just name... Uh, You can put whatever description you, that you want here, which is this area right here. You can also add in a link so when they click on it, it'll take them somewhere. Image position, right now it's in the middle. I can make it to the left or right. Right now I'm going to put it to the left. Let's go over to the Style tab. We could play around with the spacing, and you could see what the spacing does. Okay, the width. This is what the width does. So let's make this 20, make this 40. You can add up a border radius. Radius. Uh, let's see. Hover animation, let's uh, just put in uh, grow for right now. You can see what that does. OK, 
Okay, I'm just gonna not encode it for right now. Okay. The content. This will, uh, this is what the content is. So alignment top that moves over the image itself. So I'm just going to put it in the middle for right now. Spacing, the title of the spacing, you can see what the spacing does. The color, let's change the color of the title, which is the name of the individuals. Typography, you can play around with this again. This is something that you could play around with it. You could change the weight of it. See how it changes the weight of the title itself. And transform the text to all uppercase or capitalize. Okay, there's many different options to spruce this up. The description is going to be this area right here. So let's change this to black. Again, you have a number of different options. You could change the font, you can change the size of the text, everything underneath here. So there's a lot of different options. Once you have the look and feel of what you want, then all you have to do is for this intersection is copy it and then come back over here right click and paste and then all you have to do then is come back over here change the images scroll over here Insert the media. Give it a second to load up as it loads up again. And then the more testimonials you want in this particular section, all you have to do then is copy this inner section or duplicate it. And there you have it. And then all you do then is come over here to the right, select each image box widget, and then just swap out your images, change the title, the description, and everything you want. And then it'll look like this, what we got here. So there's many different ways that you can play around to make a testimonial section for your WordPress website using the Elementor page builder and the multiple widgets that we have. Again, I added a section, then within the section, I added a heading element and then an uh, inner section widget and then an image box widget. And then you learned different techniques on how to copy things over and everything. So um, hopefully this tutorial gave you some ideas on how to create a specific section that will list out your testimonials for your own business. Remember to like, share, and comment, and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And thank you for stopping by, and I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Bye now.